Hi, my name is Ishan and I was working on sonoluminescence at the Advanced Undergraduate Physics Laboratory. Sonoluminescence requires the right apparatus, the right skill, and luck. After finding the correct frequency, one of the hardest parts is to finding the correct size bubble for the bubble to sonoluminesce. The heater and the usual syringe method require a lot of luck, so I designed and implemented my own device that automatically generates the right size bubbles required for solar luminescence with just a push of a button on your smartphone. I used a Bluetooth enabled Arduino, a motor driver, and connected this to a linear actuator that pushes the syringe plunger forward at 1mm increments. There's still some work to be done to perfect this, but I think I'm off to a good start. I exploited the manual white balance feature on DSLR to qualitatively measure the temperature of solar luminescence in distilled degassed water. By taking several images at different color temperatures, single sonoluminescent bubbles seem to be at a natural white color at around 9300 Kelvin, suggesting that this is the temperature due to the collapse of the bubbles. If I had more time, I would increase my data set by having many more photos with different parameters along with the calibration process to increase the accuracy of my results. Instead of qualitatively looking at the RGB histogram, I was thinking of writing a script to extract the colors for a color average and color temperatures for a better temperature reading this fascinating phenomenon. I had a really fun time working on this experiment and a big thank you to Professor Bailey for all your help.